New York, 2003, during the General Assembly of the United Nations, a resolution on sport is submitted. The resolution is entitled, Sport as a Means to Promote Education, Health, Development and Peace. On November 3, 2003, the resolution is adopted. Volunteers strive to implement the resolution on sport in some of the most dramatic situations. They've lost their friends, they've lost their relatives. So they will come here, they will make friends. I think training is what will help them to improve their mental you know, health. So in this place they will learn some things about life and how they can overcome their sorrow, how they can help each other. So I think yeah, sure, it has a very good social role. A lot of successful projects have been set up in refugee camps, for instance. Sport helps me a lot. Basketball makes me healthier and I have fun playing, that's what I believe. I don't know what the future holds for me, but I think I need to be ready for anything, for any situation. That's why I'm trying my best to become a good basketball player and to be an educated person, for my future. There are children here who every time you talk to them, they talked about war. And when they played games, they played with make-believe guns. They played at being soldiers. But when we introduce them to communication games, group games, little by little these same children tried to forget about playing guns and soldiers, and now they know that there are other games, peaceful games, games about living together. That's the kind of change in behavior I've seen here, thanks to sport. When communication breaks down between communities, sometimes the one place they can still meet is on the football field. We don't know each other, but if we play a soccer match, our relation automatically will be different after playing one hour together. We learn to, to communicate each other without talking. So it's a way to communicate to, with the people and to have a different relation. This is a good example uh, how sport can bring people together. Sports unites them and brings people, communities from different countries, different nationalities, different tribes, religions together. Sport as a means to promoting development and peace can help to achieve the Millennium Development Goals. Sport is a language every one of us can speak. When we do, we can bridge social, economic, religious and cultural divides. We can help improve the well-being of individuals and communities. We can inspire hope in ourselves and others. At the World Summit in 2005, all the world's governments declared that sport can foster peace and development and can contribute to an atmosphere of tolerance and understanding. That is why the United Nations is using sport as a cost-effective tool to reach the Millennium Development Goals, the common vision adopted by all countries for a better world. And it is why the United Nations is turning to sport to support people recovering from armed conflict, especially young people. Let us mobilize the power of sport in our quest for peace and development around the world. Thank you.